Oh my gosh. I just went in the pool. I look like a little bit of a mess. But, oh my gosh. I have powders and bronzers that I need to declutter. Like, I can't even close the drawer. I literally have like, so much stuff shoved in there. We just need to go through it and declutter and... Uh, okay, let's just do it. I feel like I'm always decluttering because I'm always like gathering things and I film my decluttering series like over time Yeah, so then I gather more while I'm decluttering. It's just like uh, it's just like an always an endless cycle of makeup So let's just go through the bronzers and the powders <sighs> Yes, this is this uh, just like oh my gosh I feel like everything's gonna break just so easily and okay, let's just do this. Okay, so uh, right here I have powders that like, I don't even know if these are all powders. So this is all, I think, powders. This is all bronzers, and this is my cream bronzers. But then again, there's a powder right over here. I don't even know what's going on here. So, uh, this is my Alme Smart Shade Powder. I really like, this is the best loose powder from the drugstore, in my opinion. Way, just, ah, uh, it's just out of this world, to be honest. It's super creamy. It just makes your skin look really, like, ah, uh, airbrushed and flawless. I used this on the day I went to a premiere, and my skin did not flash back. It looked just so good. So, Alme Smart Shade Powder. I'm in the shade Light. Um, so it just adjusts to your face, but really really good. So I'm gonna keep that. I have my Derma Blend little loose powder. Um, I heard it's like waterproof. Is that correct? I don't even know, but it doesn't look like something I'd ever use. Oh yeah, water re resistant. I don't know. I'm just gonna pass that. It doesn't doesn't look like it. Wait, actually, this is usually the other way around. This is my pass pile. And this is my key pile. Okay, I'm gonna pass the Derma Blend translucent little powder thingy. I literally got it like forever ago, and I still haven't used it once. <laughs> um, maybe I should try it, but I just I don't know. It just doesn't seem like a great product. It looks for my skin type. Um, oh, this is a cream. This is a foundation, Fiona. Um, oh yeah, I gathered this. Oh wait. I don't know, wait. I swear I decluttered this. Ah, uh, I sometimes I swear, okay, wait. I don't know what happened here, but I do actually like this. I don't know what happened. Um, maybe there was another one. Oh yeah, I probably had another one in here because I have a lot of 100% pure. Maybe, I don't know what happened, but I'm gonna put that back in my foundations. Um, anywho, next I have this little NYX HD powder. I haven't even tried it yet, so I will keep that. But um, maybe actually, it might give it away to somebody. I feel like somebody else might like this more than me. So I think I'm gonna pass that, but this is brand new, so I'll probably just give it away. I haven't even swatched it. Um, and it's like in a seal. Um, I have this little... Mmm, Revolution Luxury Powder. I feel like this could be good, but also, I don't know. I just feel like it's like banana, so I just don't feel like it looks that good on my skin type and skin tone, because my skin's super dry and everything, um, and it's yellow based. And I, I have yellow undertones, but it just looks too dark for me. I'm gonna keep both of my Better Skin powders. Oh wait, these are my gift cards. I'm gonna, oh wait, I think I just have one in here. I'm gonna keep that. I have like my iTunes gift cards in here. It's kind of a weird place to put it, but I do. Oh, and I have some more gift cards here. Woo! Um, but I'm gonna keep both of my better skin powders. One is for my darker days, and one is for my lighter days. So I can mix the two. I really do enjoy this powder, I'll have to say. One of the best from the drugstore. Um, yeah, Maybelline Better Skin Powder, because it's like waterproof, and it's like skin transforming, if you will. Um, then I have this Pure Powder. Uh, which I'm gonna keep. It's just a very, very velvety powder. I really do like it. Very, very important to me. I think it's like one of the best. Um, this little Clinique powder I got like as a sample. Um, I'm gonna pass it. I just, uh, I'm not, I don't think I'm gonna use it. Um, I have this e.l.f. powder, which I do really like. Um, it's the, it's like $2. Um, but, I don't know, do I need it? I've honestly used a lot of it. What am I talking in? What happened there? Um, I don't even know. Uh, but I think, mm, gosh, this is so hard for me. I think I'm gonna pass it. I just, I, it's not my favorite, but it is a really good, really, really cheap option. Um, then I have my CoverGirl Advanced Radiant Powder. To be honest, I'm gonna keep this, uh, because it's really good. It's just really good. But I don't use it a lot because it's not the healthiest. Uh, I'm gonna keep my Hourglass Ambient Lighting Powder as well. Um, so I think I'm getting rid of like half. Yeah, yeah, that is actually half, so cool. But I do see a powder here. This is just a translucent powder. This is the Silica Bamboo Powder from 100% Pure. Can you even see it? It's really hard to see it because it's not focusing. Um, but yeah, it's a bamboo blur powder and I'm gonna keep this because it is only one ingredient, which is pretty magical. Okay, so I have, this is awesome. Honestly, I've repurchased this because I shattered my other one. <laughs> uh, uh, but this is the CoverGirl True Blend Bronzer. I love this in my crease um, and on the perimeter of the face. It's super bronzy. Then I have one of my favorite bronzers ever from the drugstore. This is the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Press Powder in Golden Tan. Definitely 100% gonna keep that. Super, super good. It's not a bronzer, but it's a powder. But it's, it's just, a, I just got it in a darker shade. Um, I have my Pure Bronzer in, um, I'm not sure the shade actually. 
Mineral Glow. So I'm gonna keep that because it's a nice healthy-ish product. Uh, my Butter Bronzer, I'm gonna pass. I don't know why, it's just, it never works as well as like others. It works so good for everyone, but it just, I don't know. I just, I really don't like the fragrance of it because it gives me breakouts along my hairline, which is kind of irritating. Um, then I have the Balm Bahama Mama Bronzer. Um, I think I'm gonna, Oh gosh, I'm not sure. Should I pass it? Should I not? I think I'm gonna keep this one. I'm gonna pass my little Smashbox contour kit. It's just, I don't know. It's not my favorite palette for like that kind of shebang. Actually, you know what? I think I will keep it because this is the only contouring product I have. Like a contour. Oh wait, that's maybe a lie. I'm not sure. But I like how compact it is and if I really wanted to carve out my cheekbones then I'll use it. I have my bronzy, quotation mark, um, L'Oreal Lumi. I love L'Oreal Lumi, so I got a bronzy shade. It's my, my creamy bronzer. Um, then I have a pop powder. Is it a powder? Yeah, it's a powder. I think it's just, I got another like, dark shade. Yeah, shall I keep it? I don't know. I think I'm gonna keep, um, I think I'm gonna keep the, this one right here. Oh, well, do I really need to? I don't think I'm gonna keep that one, but I'll keep the slightly darker version of it for maybe more of a deep contour. Um, then I have my 100% Pure Cocoa Bronzer. It's actually super, super good. Um, yeah, I'm gonna keep this one from 100% Pure. One of my favorites for sure. My Revolution Heart Bronzer, um, triple baked, so good. I'm definitely gonna keep that. My Essence Bronzer, I'm also gonna keep. Oh gosh, I'm keeping a lot. Um, I'm gonna get rid of this. This is a Reserve Your Cabana thingy. I don't know, actually I really like it though, shoot. Uh, there's really not good sunblocks in here, so I'm actually gonna pass that. Um, then I'm gonna go in with, not go in, I'm gonna go into like my cream contours and my facial sprays. Oh geez, I have a lot in here actually. I don't know how much I have in here. Um, but I have my Milani Make It Last. I really actually do like it, but it just, I don't really use it. I use like a rather hydrating facial spray. Um, I'm gonna keep this. This is my Vitamin Hydrating Mist uh, from First Aid Beauty. Actually, you know what, I think I'm gonna pass this because I don't really use it a lot. Um, I have something way better, but um, this is pretty good, but um, I have something way better because I don't know I just don't like the spray on that one. Then I have this right here. This is the wet n wild contour crayon I think mm, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna pass this one. It's just very dark on me So I think I'm gonna pass it. I have a Neutrogena Hydra boosting um, Little foundation in a dark shade. I'm gonna keep that as a cream contour because I do like it for that uh, very much. Oh, I'm gonna have a blush in here. Jeez Louise, Fiona. I feel like everything, oh, are you ready for this next door that we're gonna declutter? Yeah, don't even, yep, it's it's really bad. It's really bad, just don't, just don't look at it. Um, then I have some jewelry pieces, which obviously it should not be in here. I'm gonna keep them, but I'm gonna put them in my organization. Then I have my little Chanel bronzer. I'm gonna keep this, even though, to be honest, there's so many better products from the drugstore, uh, but of course I'm gonna keep it because it's Chanel, you know, you can't throw it away. Um, and I have my Park Ave Princess palette. I'm gonna keep this from Tarte. Well, I feel like I'm definitely keeping a lot, but I'm still getting rid of a decent amount as well. I'm gonna get rid of this facial mist. It just didn't really work for me. Oh my gosh, I have mint packs in here. Oh my gosh, I need to like put that on my bag. Not on my bag, in my bag, so I can use those up. Um, I have a red nose from Red Nose Day. Um, you can like donate, and like you, you like donate when you buy a little nose, so I think I'm gonna now pass this away. Um, but it was fun while I had it. Then I have an old prescription of mine. Actually, you know, I need to keep that. Never mind. That's for my eye drops because I had like an eye irritation. Anywho, yep. Okay, so this is just a mirror of mine, so I will keep that back here. And let's put this all away. Boom! Look at that. I have my powder bronzers, my cream bronzers, and my powders. And then I have my mirror and a palette back there. Everything like fits so well. And I think it looks just so cute and well organized. And look how much more I can fit in all of this. So. Thank you so much for helping me declutter, and bye.